There are many factors to consider when explaining why low-income minority students are achieving below grade level in urban schools. Some of those reasons include inadequate resources, unsuitable learning environments, and lack of quality education. At the root of all of that, before the low-income minority student can be faced with subpar learning, they have a plethora of needs that have not yet been fulfilled. In my opinion, low-income minority students are achieving below grade level because their needs have not been met. According to Abraham Maslow, a psychologist that studied human development and motivation, the most basic needs must be met in order for a person to be motivated to achieve the higher order of needs. From basic to higher order, their needs are psychological, security, love belongingness, esteem, and self-actualization. The typical low-income minority student is struggling with the first three needs in this hierarchy. The student may be lacking stability within their households because their families are struggling financially and are therefore lacking structure. In an unstable, unstructured environment, it is also typical that trust, love, and a sense of belonging is lacking. Knowing the basic things that students may be lacking coming into the classroom will be important for me to establish relationships with students and their families, encourage goal setting and achieving, provide hope and more positive role models, teach students responsibility and accountability, and most importantly, practice empathy. By building relationships with students and their families, I'll be able to better support the students and provide them with a more individualized education. Once I have a better understanding of who the student is as a person, I will be able to provide them with the support and guidance needed to create and achieve goals. By providing students with more positive role models, they are able to see that their goals are attainable and their current situations are temporary, thus sustaining hope for their futures. Thank you.